So first thing you gotta do is make sure the tag exists. So the schedule workshop and AC goal to the right. Schedule workshop AC goal. Yeah, the tag goal. So open this guy up. And we already do have a tag for it. Perfect. So I guess I must have set that up. Okay. So that's step one. Okay. Now we can go into appointment court because the tag exists. So if the tag didn't exist, we'd need to create it. Do you want to go through that step? With the second, uh, yeah, keep going. Is the post workshop one on one? That is also okay. So both those tags exist. So we just need to create the links for them then. Okay, within appointment core. Okay. So let's go ahead and uh, we'll create a new booking link. And let's copy settings from a previous event. And let's look at, uh, uh, I guess let's do the one hour rental for now. Cool, so the name of this is the, uh, I think it's the Ultimate Job Seeker Workshop. Yeah, J. Yeah, that's what I was. Is it? Shift J. Yeah, I guess. Cool. All right, and then as far as the description, it's a live group workshop with Tessa. Cool. All right, so let's keep going. Uh, continue to next step. One hour. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it must be both this day in advance. Uh, cool. Oh, cool. Cool. So under the number of attendees per slot, if you don't scroll, this is where we need to get fancy. So look at the advanced options there. Okay, so let's set it at um, I think like ten at the most. And then check the box, show until capacity is full. Okay. And then that's really the only fancy piece. Uh, and then, oh, also allow reschedule cancel. Hit above that, hit yes. I'll okay. check uh, the, the setting before the attendees per slot. Setting before allow reschedule, yes. Do you want to prevent or cancel reschedule? Yeah. Okay. Okay, yeah, do, do 24 hours. Just why the hell not. Okay. Um, if it becomes that. a problem, mm -hmm. like, she'll let us know. Yep. And then continue. Mm -hmm. Cool. So, uh, cool. So, those are the text message things. Let's, uh, I don't think that's in the plan, and we'll get to that later. The text message things where you're looking this like automation a trigger. Okay. There's built in text messaging for yeah. We're not worried about that. So yes, turn off automatic email confirmations. Mm -hmm. And then yes, turn off the default emails to the customer. This one? Yep, keep that. No, keep that. We'll keep it. We do want to keep the internal team member emails in because okay. I don't want to rebuild all those. Um Okay, cool. So now we need to select the proper tag. So get rid of the so X the one hour rental scheduled. And then go select the, the proper tag, which it already exists. Yep. Uh, I believe is the integrations. integrations <laughs> yep. And then <laughs> schedule workshop via AC. Cool. Schedule workshop, this guy. And let's, we can go back to the, the campaign. Let's double check that that is indeed the proper tag. Okay, cool. Perfect. Mm -hmm. Okay, so back to here. Uh, look at the advanced additional automation options. And uh, we're not doing any cancel reschedule stuff, but if you see, we are doing the custom fields. So, yes date. Oh, custom fields, okay. Mm -hmm. So session date, let's change that. I believe there's a workshop date now. And then for the time, there should also be a workshop time. Cool. And... Uh, I'm 
I'm not sure what the fuck that is. Uh, and then continue the next step. That's it. Okay. So now we have the link. So copy the link to the clipboard. Go to the campaign. And we need to make a campaign link for it. Which you should know how to do from here. Actions. Links. Link. This is the group workshop calendar link. Is the, this is the link where people book their group workshop. And save it. Cool. And then close it. And you can stop the recording. That's it.